Hi everyone! I know it's been a really long time since I've been doing any of my videos. I recently started my practice back up and it's really taken so much of my time that I've really been like the universe has been saying you need to go back and do these videos and I've been just trying to fit it in and one of my clients today asked me, you know, where am I with my book? Because there are a few books that I want to write. And I was like trying to explain my, just my explanation. And, and then I was like digging inside, analyzing myself all at the same time going, is that really the answer you want to give him? Like, is that like my, my honest, honest truth answer? I dug deep and I, and I, cause I don't like, so I'm going to tell you first that I am a clinical massage therapist. I treat chronic pain and the way that I treat chronic pain is through kind of digging deep inside your soul to figure out where your actual physical pain is coming from because physical pain really doesn't hurt as bad as negative muscle memory does. And so if I want my clients to be honest with me, I feel like I have to be 100% honest with them all the time. Because if, if not, why? What's the point of even doing what I do? If I can't be honest with them, how are they going to pull out all of their honesty with me? And uh, I, I try my best to be 100% of a human being who's living and thriving in honesty and 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 respecting myself while respecting the people that I'm taking care of or or giving my time to or they're giving me their time and so the honest answer is I I was a kind of afraid I said I'm afraid of writing these books because even though my clients and the people I know all agree with me, you know, what about the trolls out there? And what if, you know, like, who knows? Like, and that's really just negative talk from your head, right? It's fears, honestly, from childhood of, you know, maybe people not agreeing with you as a child of whatever you said, and now you're taking it into your adult life and you're like, oh, okay, well, crap, what if, you know, this person doesn't agree with me and that person doesn't agree with me? And realistically, I mean, who cares? I, I don't want to be, I'm not trying to be harsh, but I want to be brutally honest because being brutally honest is not a common thing anymore, right? We've got reality tv which people love you know why they love it because uh, hopefully you're being your true self whether that's a crazy person or or not because i watch some reality tv and i'm like that person's not as crazy as everybody's making her out to be <laughs> so sorry got sidetracked um <laughs> so i a little bit scared, intimidated about writing these books, about even now doing my speeches. I'm a part of Toastmasters and I've set goals of, you know, I want to do this speech. I want to do that speech. I haven't gotten any of them done. I'm annoyed with myself, which unfortunately pressures me even more because I'm kind of type A and I'm trying not to be so type A and whew, that's all a lot, but it's also just part of being an adult, part of being human, part of being part of trying to be a good person, which you know what? We're not always going to be. And I just listen, finished listening to this guy on Instagram that I follow. I think his first name is Ty. Um, and he was talking about how, like, you know, if you have something to say, you just need to say it. Don't be scared. Don't be like, don't, because if you don't say it, 
every day passes you by time you can't get time back and it keeps slipping you it keeps slipping you and he's right and i feel like i keep failing everybody who's waiting for my next video because i'm not producing enough but at times i'm also like my videos are so raw they're not as good as other people's videos because i'm doing this by myself and it's just me you know and i i have a full-time practice and before i had a full-time practice i had a full-time job and i you know i'm it's also not just myself i take care of my mother who you know i mean when you're taking care of somebody else it's kind of a lot you know and and i feel responsible for her even though she's an adult i feel responsible for her and i want to be 100 percent you know when i can for her just as much as when i can for my clients just as much as when i can for everybody who's watching my videos so <laughs> In conclusion today, 